Hi, my name is S. Hari Siddharth. I am studying in class 10 and I am going to shortly appear for standard 10 term 2 board examinations. In class 8, when I was going to a private max tuition, I approached my sir and asked for a good institution to crack JE. He suggested me AHA Guru. By that way, I joined in AHA Guru. I took the recorder videos class to take uh, to get an idea of how the methodology of learning in AHA Guru works. In class 10, I shifted to online live classes so that I'll be able to get more clear uh, clarity in my concepts. So how does the methodology work? Actually, I feel that this methodology is very, very unique compared to other things. Like uh, you, we will be revising the online lessons twice. That is each lesson in our NCRT book will be revised twice. And in the online class also, sir will be doing it in great depth. That is first we'll be assigning some online lessons for the week on that lesson. And on the same lesson, sir will be doing the class in great depth. We'll be solving around 40 to 50 questions, which is a lot of practice per week per subject. I actually took physics, chemistry and max for standard 10 and standard 9. I am planning to continue with AHA, AHA Guru for standard 11 and standard 12 since I'm enjoying the classes and having fun with it. We'll be having many interactive sessions like we'll be having many quizzes and tests in the online classes which makes the class more fun and more entertaining. And moreover, Balai Sambhatsar's classes made the concepts crystal clear. For example, in standard 10, we have a lesson called magnetism. In magnetism, as we all know, we have many laws such as right hand thumb rule, Fleming's left hand rule, Fleming's right hand rule and so on. I felt that all of these rules together when learned were very, very confusing. But when Balai Sambhatsar told that right hand thumb rule is the basic rule for all the other rules i thought we should then learn right hand thumb rule clearly sir taught us right hand thumb rule in a very very simple way and this helped us master other two rules very easily now i feel that magnetism is the easiest chapter in class 10 science and in physics compared to electricity also magnetism is much more uh, easy uh, when we take the uh, example of chemistry santanam sir and dp shankaran sir would relate the concepts in chemistry to a lot of stories. These stories will help us to uh, understand the concepts and uh, make the concepts get into our minds very easily. For example, D.P. Shankaran sir related a story of sigma bond and pi bond to the uh, story of handshaking. He told that uh, shaking hands straightly is like sigma bond. This is because we spend our less energy when we shake hands straightly. So the bond is more stronger, so it's sigma bond. When we shake our hands on top of our head, we spend more of our energy. On that case, it becomes a weak bond, so it's a pipe bond. Like this, many of the stories are being related and being created by the Aha Guru teachers, which makes it very unique and makes us master the problems and the concepts very easily. And moreover, we had many of the tests. That is, we have, we'll be having a, a test every week, which would make us uh, know where we stand on that chapter or, or on that particular concept. We'll be also having consolidated tests and mock tests which made me uh, feel very confident. This is because the consolidated test and mock test will be of a higher standard that is basically not on the CBC level, based on the CBC concepts but on a bit more higher level. On that note, when I solve that higher level problems, I get the confidence to solve the easier problems. So I am able to get more and more confidence and easy and, and it becomes easy for me to solve the problems. And also the mentors help us in many ways. Like when we have a doubt while solving a sample we or solving a question in the online lesson, when we message them and ask them, they reply instantly and we get our doubts solved instantly. And in the live classes also, sir will be clearing all of our doubts within that session instantly. So all our doubts get solved. On the whole, AHA Guru helped me a lot to score 193 out of 200 in my CBC term 1 board examinations and I love the learning in AHA Guru so I am planning to continue for standard 11 and standard 12. Thank you.